But what was once a crowded four-way race for the Democratic nomination for governor in Montana is now down to a choice between two candidates and both have deep political roots here in the state. Tonight, MTN's Jay Cohn zeroes in on the Democratic primary contest between Mike Cooney and Whitney Williams. Democrats have controlled the governor's office in Montana for 16 straight years. Brian Schweitzer started the current streak in 2004, serving two terms. Steve Bullock then followed suit in 2012, also winning two terms in the governor's chair. Who will Democrats pin their hopes on in 2020? It's shaping into a battle between two candidates who both hail from prominent Montana political families. 65-year-old Lieutenant Governor Mike Cooney was just 18 when Butte voters sent him to Helena as Montana's youngest state lawmaker in 1976. Politics have been his calling ever since. Mike Cooney has fought like hell for the people of Montana. My, that, and and I, have a rec, I have a record to show for it. In 1989, Cooney began an 11-year run as Montana's Secretary of State. He then served eight years as a state senator and since 2016 has been Montana's lieutenant governor. What this is all about and what Montanans are really going to say is who can fight the hardest for us, who knows how to get the job done, who has been tested, and I think the bottom line is they're going to come down and say the choice is Mike Cooney for governor. Mike hopes to follow in his grandfather's footsteps. Frank Henry Cooney served as Montana's ninth governor from 1933 to 1935. To rally Democratic voters, Cooney is proposing that Montana allow drug imports from Canada as a way to slash prescription drug prices. He vows another run at getting the legislature to fund pre-kindergarten and says Montanans favor responsible development of our natural resources. I think we have a record of supporting our natural resource development. We want to do it the Montana way. We don't think people should just come in and be able to write their own rules and regulations and get away with things. We want to protect our outdoor heritage. Vying with Cooney for the Democratic nod for governor is 48-year-old Whitney Williams. Whitney's making her first run at elected office, but comes with her own political pedigree. Her father, Pat, was Montana's longest-serving congressman until his retirement in 1997. Her mother, Carol, was the state Senate's first female majority leader. Williams sees herself as the new generation of Montana Democrats who bring new energy and expertise to the table. I have a different skill set, I have a different expertise, I have a different sensibility, and I've solved very different problems in my career, and I think that that's what Montana needs. Williams founded her own company, Williams Works, in 2003. As CEO, she advises corporations, foundations, and individuals on everything from solving complex problems to philanthropy. As governor, she vows to fight for continued access to public lands and says it's time the legislature bites the bullet to fund pre-kindergarten. It's never easy to get these policies enacted, but it's well past time that we educate the four-year-olds in the state. I know the legislature and the governor have tried to do that uh, through a number of sessions, and I think 2021 is going to be our session.